um, F15-13303. Okay, Mr. Booth, I have a question for you. This may appear to be your regular everyday interaction between a judge and a defendant, but guess what? It's much, much more. And, and look, she has a question for him. What could it be? Hmm. Let's continue. Fifth, um, F15-13303. Okay, Mr. Booth, I have a question for you. Yes, ma'am. Did you go to Nautilus for middle school? Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. I'm sorry oh. to see you there. I always wondered what happened to you, sir. Oh, my. It just hit him. He knows the judge from middle school. And we can only imagine what is running through his mind. Share your thoughts in the comments section, what you think is going through his mind. But let's continue. My goodness. This is the nicest kid in middle school. Oh my goodness. He was the best kid in middle school. I used to play football with him and all the kids. And look what has happened. I'm so sorry. To oh my goodness. Mr. Booth, I hope you were able to change your ways. Good luck to you. Oh my goodness. What's sad is how old we've become. Oh my goodness. Good luck to you, sir. I hope you were able to come out of this okay and just lead a lawful life. Well, as I said, it was a little emotional. Because it was much more than just an interaction between a judge and a defendant. It was two classmates who haven't seen each other in a long time. Their lives crossed, you know, went different directions. One was in a criminal justice system and one was a, a law abiding citizen, um, you know, practicing law, upholding the law as a judge. Wow. What an interaction, man. So I felt the tears that he was crying, man. I think I had to fight back a couple. But I want to thank y'all, man, for watching the video. Like and share this video, man. Tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend. You know, um, share your thoughts in the comment section. There's a lot to talk about. Man, I want to hear... Y'all explain, man, how would you feel or what would be what would be going through your mind if you were the defendant? Also, on a flip end, man, I want y'all to talk about from the judge's perspective because she could have just kept it to herself and not said anything. But I guess with the, with the close, you know, relationship or friendship that they had, you know, in middle school, she wanted to let him know so she would have the opportunity to encourage him to change his ways and do the right thing. Man, this was a beautiful uh, interaction. I'm thank thankful that I was able to bring it to you. Um, but like I said, share it in the comments section. If you have not done it already, man, subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell, man, so that you can be notified, you know, when I put out a new video, man. Again, I thank you, man. But I really appreciate this. I appreciate from the judge. And I appreciate how humble the defendant was and how he responded, man. He let it go. And that was probably necessary, you know, for him and his well-being. Thanks again, man. Y'all be safe. Try to stay out the system. Do the right thing. Abide by the law. Make good, positive, responsible decisions. Until next time, man, y'all be safe. Peace.